Episode 4 of The Lawman, Bass Reeves kicks off with Bass singing while shooting a hole in a hat. Obviously, he wants to disguise himself and appear non-threatening when he arrives at a woman's door to arrest her two sons. The widow was at first suspicious of his appearance, but she later lowered her rifle and invited him inside when he quoted the Bible. Her two adult children showed up on time for dinner and ended up fighting between themselves as their mother and the lawman watched without interfering. While everyone is asleep, Bass quietly places them in handcuffs and they are stunned to wake up in the morning to find themselves under arrest. Many people are starting to despise Bass as a result of his taking on numerous assignments in the South to track down the most wanted men. Fortunately, Bass has gotten used to watching his back because of the bounty placed on his head. Bass Reeves is tracking wanted men in every direction, accepting jobs one after another and bringing them back into town to answer for their crimes. One evening, while Bass is fast asleep, one of the inmates tries to attack him. But Bass is quick on his feet and overcomes him, nearly killing him with a series of vicious blows until Billy Crow restrains him. The lawman has generated a target on his back as he takes down an increasing number of guys. He has been informed that there is a bounty on his head and it is quite a large one. In episode 3, we saw that Garrett Montgomery became Bass's first posse man, but after a shootout, Garrett was killed. In that same episode, we see Bass hunting for Billy Crow as he was a wanted man. After finding him, Bass turned him into Judge Parker but told him that Billy was just confused. Although Judge Parker didn't care to hear the excuses, he allowed Bass to make Billy Crow his new posse man. Bass's next case had him follow the tracks of Silas Cobb. Bass goes from town to town, hoping he finds him as he has done in the past. We see him enter a brothel where he knows Silas is. Bass confronts Silas and tells him he has to take him in, but the woman that he was with has other plans and pulls a gun on Bass. Silas immediately sees that opportunity to escape. Silas escapes and is able to get on a horse to head out of town because Billy Crow was busy flirting with a prostitute instead of guarding the horses. Billy Crow later sees him and Silas begins riding the horse at him and fiercely passes him. Billy pulls out his gun and shoots Silas, which leads to him falling off the horse and dying moments later before Reeves could bring help. Bass pays a visit to Silas's blind wife to deliver a letter with his last words. The woman asks about Silas and he breaks the news that her husband has died. She wasn't surprised because she knew that her husband was an adulterer and a criminal. She asks him to read the letter obviously because she is blind. Unknown to her that he cannot read, Bass puts the letter back inside his pockets and says some emotional words from his heart while he pretends to read the letter. Tell us what you think about this episode in the comments section.